for this your man Spill Dog coming back at you with another one. Speaking on Canelo Alvarez, why don't they have him for pound for pound? I have no idea. It got to be biased to people who is deciding who is the pound for pound because how can you put any 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 guy from 160 on down ahead of Canelo? Which one? What, what guy from 160 on down can beat Canelo? Nobody. What guy from 160 on down has the resume that Canelo has? Nobody. Uh, Canelo went 24 rounds with Triple G. Didn't get knocked down once. Didn't get seriously hurt. Not one time. Triple G done banged out some great fighters. I mean, banged them straight out. So, how come Canelo not getting his respect? I don't understand that. Uh, I'm not a fan, boy. I like good boxing. If you look at Canelo Alvarez and tell me he ain't a complete fighter, you you lying to your motherfucking self. Canelo is the real deal. The man got a beautiful jab. He got beautiful footwork. He moved around the ring wonderfully. He got great body shots, a great left hook, good right hand, great chin. He proved that fighting 24 rounds with Triple G and not getting knocked down or out. Uh, They've they been in the ring with all the best. He got good defense. Now, like I say, the only thing you can say about Canelo is in a few big fights. In like in the 12th round, he might have gassed out a little bit and, and was trying to, you know, move around and kill the clock. But outside of that, you, you, can, you can't really find a flaw or crack in the man game. Danny Jacobs finna fight him in May. Danny Jacobs finna get a scoop. And I like Danny Jacobs. I, I got respect for him. I got respect for his trainer. He will not beat Canelo. It's not going to happen. Not going to happen. It's, I mean, it's nice to, ooh, yeah, he bigger. Yeah, he got to reach. Yeah, Canelo done dealt with all that. He is finna disrespect Danny Jacobs' glamour. That's what's finna happen. The boy is not whooping Canelo. Ain't none of them cats ready for Canelo now. That's a good payday. I will fight him for the money and for the experience to fighting the best. But thinking you finna get in there and beat Canelo, you're gonna have to show me that. I don't see it. Danny Jacobs will not beat Canelo Alvarez. I have, I, I ain't no qualms in my mind. I can't wait till they put the odds out. Because if Danny Jacobs is somehow favored, I'm finna run down there and make my bet. Trust me, he ain't gonna beat Canelo. That's all I'm saying. Uh, Canelo, in my opinion, might be the best boxer in boxing right now since Floyd going just all around the whole package. Who you? I ain't seen. I have not seen better so far. You gotta remember, Andre Ward is retired right now. Now, if Andre Ward's here, we'd be having a different conversation. But Andre Ward and Floyd Mayweather, as far as I know, are not fighting right now. So since they gone, the the, the guys Canelo. Anybody thinking anything different, they bump their head up against the wall. Real talk. I mean, Canelo Alvarez, he that's what's popping right now. I mean, you know, so if you, if, if 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 we want to speak about who was pound for pound, and if people want to start talking about pound for pound, if you're not bringing Canelo Alvarez up in the in the conversation, you're not having a a, a real honest conversation with yourself. You 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 going by what you hear these reporters. And these uh and these uh, announcers who work for these networks say they saying what they pay what people tell them to say to some degree, but how can you tell how can you how can, how can any of these guys be pound for pound when the biggest fight of the year is Triple G and Canelo he won, uh put any of their resumes up Canelo's don't compare who they fought to who he fought don't compare. So, I mean, until these guys start stepping up and fighting the level of competition that Canelo's fighting and winning, they don't deserve to be even spoke on nowhere close to ahead of Canelo. Like I say, now, after you put him up number one, I say between Keith Thurman, Errol Spence, Terrence Crawford, however you want to go to one, to two, three, and four, I'm fine with that. Pacquiao, you know, I'm fine with all that. But Canelo need to be on the top of that list. That's all I'm saying. Uh, if you agree with me, leave a comment. If you like the video, subscribe. That's it for this one. I'm out. One.